This is the Canvas Workspace, the online version. I'm just going to show you how to upload. Go up to the SVG uh, icon and then this box will pop out. Choose File. You have to have a little search to find your file. Um, when, once you've found your folder, you, you go to your folder. Uh, mostly you'll save things into documents or pictures. I've saved mine into documents and under Mandala. You go and find it at Mandala. If you've downloaded it from the net, choose SVG and then pick your file and go OK. And you'll see the file name there. And so you select OK. And which will bring the um, SVG or the FCM file into your Canvas workspace. When it comes in, it's actually as separate pieces. So you can click on it and it will, will look like one, but really it's not. You'll see the size by working down the mat. Oh, the mat's got the inches and the centimeters. So you can work out how big your design is. If it's not the right size. You'll need to regroup, to group it, sorry. Um, how to manage the file is in here in edit. You'll see the group icons and the edit icon. Uh, um, had a layer in here. And then you've got other features in this one. If you select that and it doesn't find an object, you actually have to select an object for that box to drop down. Uh, in the first instance, I would group the fold by dragging a mouse and clicking over it, going up there and grouping it. You'll see the box changes with the four dots on the outside corner and then dots in the middle of each line. And go drop that down. You can see the properties now come up different. Go to resize and you can change it by scale in this, this way. So 90% in this case. You can also change it up the top there um, for an actual size as well. You either check or uncheck the maintain aspect ratio so once you've got you're happy with your file you go to download and this box will pop up if you've got wi-fi it'll have one on the right for to send it straight to your scan and cut um, otherwise it will have the download to your pc where you can put it onto your usb I've got wi-fi so i've selected scan and cut and it's transferred to the machine and you just go close and then you go to your machine and um, 